friends, welcome to another video. Today we are at Five Below for the Fur Baby Drop, which I'm super excited about because there are dogs and there are a lot of dogs. And if you haven't noticed already, I'm kind of obsessed. So we're gonna go, I got Spencer with me. We are a little bit late. Uh, we're about an hour after opening, but I don't think that will be a problem. So let's go in and see what we can find. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to do a voiceover for most of this because the music was so loud. Good for shoppers, not good for YouTube. Right off the bat, I noticed some quality issues, specifically bent tags like this one on Nathaniel. And this is Tahoe, the calico cat. I had to get her because she looks like Callie. Um, Kevin and Sydney's cat from K Shizzle 15 and here I'm telling you guys I'm a big fan of the cat but also the YouTube channel both of them this is Garrett the guinea pig Rusty the rat is so cute I did not know that there were spots embroidered on the back so precious Tycho the parakeet absolutely in love Sigrid the cat. This is Yezebel. She's a first to market squish. I think she's so cute. She could probably be like a Cavalier King Charles Spaniel or a Beagle or a Cocker Spaniel. Who knows? So cute though. This is Adela and I am very confident that this is a Basset Hound. Look at those sloppy ears. But they're about the same size as the other ones. So I don't know. Still think she's a Basset. This is when I started to notice how different the shapes were. Like, look at this bird. That's not a normal shape. These poor Tahoes. I struggled so much to find a good one. They're just like so oddly squished, but not in a good squish way. I have a feeling that this location, which I don't normally go to, just got a really bad shipment. I don't know if they were just shoved in there or what, but it was really disappointing. Some of the miscellaneous Squishmallow items that they had, plenty of blind bags, a couple of the vehicles, they had these uh, dessert mystery squad bags, some Squishums, the new ones, and I asked my husband how many we could buy because I was hoping to, you know, get a bunch, but he said two, so I got two. secured I really enjoyed this squad I thought it was adorable they had some really interesting animals fantastic I am not however thrilled about the quality and usually for five below the quality for me is not it they're just not like filled very much not very plump that's not the issue this time it's that a lot of these do not have the correct shape they're kind of all over the place and i showed you some examples i was like Ugh. this the cat was by hard the by far the hardest to find a good one but i think i think this one's pretty good so yeah like i said tahoe reminds me of callie um k shizzle 15's kitty so i just wanted to make sure i had her because i'm a fan of the kittens wow she likes to bike uphill we don't have anything in common. Okay, next up we have Isabel. So cute. Yeah, probably like a beagle, um, maybe a mixed breed, a pity. Um, I mean, I just there's there's a lot of options this could be. 
Um, she is a first to market. So that is exciting. Um, let's see a little bit about her. She narrates the football game play by play with her teammates. Yeah, again, nothing in common, but I love the dogs. Okay, next doggy we have is Adela. I'm very, I'm fairly confident this is a basset hound. So yeah, maybe not the best shaped head. I don't know, it's very difficult. Um, so Adela, let's read about you. Adela is a dentist. I did go to the dentist with this week, so I guess we do have something in common. This bird, I think is so cute. And you guys know that I like to collect the funny looking birds. And I think, I mean, although this is adorable, kind of funny looking. So this is Tycho. And I know there's a bigger version, so I was really stoked to see that there was gonna be a smaller version. Sustainability engineer. So she makes eco-friendly soaps for her friends and family. I love that. And then next up is Nathaniel, which is, you know, an oldie but a goodie. We do love our Nathaniel. I believe he's a border calling. Um, I think I have, and I did not check this tag. Hmm. Oh well. He loves to swim, rap, and is a big sci-fi fanatic. Spencer and I were just talking about Wait, no, we were talking about high fantasy, not sci-fi. Okay, just kidding. That's that's good for him, though. Oh my gosh, the rest of this is just like candy. We can't go in without buying a bunch of other stuff. But I did find this. I want to put it on Logan for next year. It's so cute. Okay, then we have the two Squishville mystery bags. You never know what you're going to find in there in here, so hopefully we get something good. Caterkorn. Yay. Okay, so I actually have this one, but it's probably one of my favorite Squishville. This is Farron. She is stunning. They, I think they did a really good job of this. Um, I have like bigger versions. Uh, I love her antlers. I uh, love the color. So now I have another one I can do something with. Um, I believe that's it. So we're gonna do some of Spencer's favorite kind of hunting, which is hunting for whiskey. Um, and, and yeah, that's how our marriage works. We spend a lot of money on collectibles, but it is okay, because we're both spending money on collectibles. That's not right, that's still not okay. Okay, well, it's happening, so. Thank you all for watching. And um, let me know if you went to this drop and let me know if you found, uh, if you picked up anything and what you thought about the quality of Squish at year five below. Maybe this was just like an unfortunately packed box and all of these kind of came out odd. Um, let me know. All right, happy Squish hunting. Bye guys. Bye. Just for funsies, I wanted to show you guys the dog drop from last year at Five Below. I went all out and bought every single one. I had so much fun taking pictures, and it was just a freaking blast. So here you go. Yeah.